Good morning, Sharon High School. I'm Roman. And I'm Evan. Today is Tuesday, February 20th, 2024. Please stand and join us for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today for lunch, we're having nachos, taco meat, queso cheese, salsa, refried beans, mixed berry cup, and milk. Due to the recent success of the girls' basketball team, activities leading up to the boys' basketball team sectional week, and feedback on students who would be able to attend the dance on the scheduled date, we have decided to postpone the winter formal at this time. We apologize for any inconvenience that this might cause. We will let you know if or when we have a rescheduled date. Attention seniors, yearbook needs your help. The senior page this year will include baby pictures alongside the regular professional portraits. If you have any baby pictures that you can send, please send them to Mrs. Waite ASAP. This can be a physical copy or by email. Just a reminder that next Friday, uh, I believe it's the 23rd, <laughs> we will be doing a silent auction with Mr. Eisen's FFA banquet, or at his banquet. Next Friday, a silent auction for um, to help co cover costs for prom. So we know right now, I think we're going to have like a movie basket and some things from uh, some of the stores in town. So hopefully you and maybe your parents will come to the FFA banquet and also bid on some items for the silent auction. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. You ready? Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, Polar Plunge team update. A um, couple things. One is we have raised $4,300. Our goal is $5,000. We are doing awesome. I'd like to shout out our top raiser right now, Brady Hammock, $400. Well done, sir. Um, also, if you are on the team and you're planning to go to the event on March 1st, you got to do two things. One, raise $99 or more. Two, bring me your, your permission slips. So, if you haven't done both of those things, you're not going on March 1st, as of right now. But you still have time, so raise your money, put it on your mom's Facebook, um, bring me the permission slips. There are probably a solid 15, 20 people who have both of those things done. Otherwise, not. I'm not going to read names today, but I will next time. So, come see me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, if you still are interested and you haven't done anything, it's really surprisingly not too late. Um, come see me if you want to get started. I think that's it. Peace out. Are you looking for a prom dress? Come to Miss Callie's room on February 23rd from 3 to 4 to pick out a prom dress. These dresses are free of charge. FFA week is this week. They will be celebrating with a variety of things. One of those events is the FFA pork loin dinner. Do you want to celebrate the Sharon FFA at the FFA pork loin dinner? Email Blackston, Se Braxton Sedwick or reach out to a FFA member to get your dinner tickets. Thank you to the NHS students who helped and to everyone who donated at our blood drive last Thursday. The Vers Versity team was able to collect 24 units of blood, which will go on to save up to 72 lives. Great job, Blackhawks. 
The Sheridan Youth Assistance Program is sponsoring Career Exploration Days. Our next Career Day will be on Tuesday, February 20th. It will take place during third period and SRT. This Career Day will feature jobs in agriculture, animals, and environmental science. It will feature jobs like landscaping, farm equipment services, animal feed services, therapeutic horse riding, organic farming, and more. Please let your SRT teacher know by Thursday, February 15th, if you would like a pass to visit the Career Day, or you can email your request or questions to Ms. Sablehouse. Hi, right, I'm here with Parker. And Parker, would you rather wear the same pair of underwear for a month or the same pair of socks for a month? Socks. That's the correct answer. Hey, who am I here with? Uh, Caesar. Would you rather wear the same socks for a month or same underwear for a month? Same socks. Good answer, good answer. Alright, I'm here with Trevor. Trevor, would you rather wear the same pair of socks for a month or the same pair of underwears for a month? The uh, same pair of socks. That's the right answer. Yeah. That's the <laughs> Alright, who am I here with? Jackson. Jaden. Zane. Ben. Brady. Nolan. Would you guys rather wear the same socks for a month or same underwear for a month? Socks. 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 It's definitely the socks. 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 Alright. Who am I here with? Jackson. Jaden. Zane. Socks. I didn't ask the question. <laughs> Alright, we good? Who am I here with? Caden Fugate. Would you rather wear the same socks for a month or same underwear for a month? Same socks, bro. Good answer. I'll be honest, the other one's just musty. Are we going? Okay. Who am I here with? Meredith. Would you rather wear the same pair of socks for a month or same pair of underwear for a month? Socks. Good answer. I'm with Johnny U. And Johnny U, would you rather wear the same pair of underwear for a month or the same pair of socks for a month? For the plot, bro. Underwear! I'm Roman. And I'm Evan. You have a fantastic day, Sheridan. Hi, Mom.